Hi, I'm Ned, and this is Julie, and we are coming to teach you a free day class art journaling workshop. Yeah, so this awesome three-day art journaling workshop is packed with ideas and techniques, and not only are we going to take you step-by-step step right through the whole process of making a journal from decorating the covers to binding it, and then, of course, filling it with lots of awesome stuff, but you get the two of us, two very different, very awesome, very fun teachers. <laughs> we're going to have a really good time. So in this video, what we're going to do is we're going to show you a little bit about what you're going to be learning, and then a little bit about each of us and our teaching style and what we hope you'll take away. The difference between a class in person and online is that you can get like instant feedback of what you're doing. One of the things about taking a workshop that can be a little bit scary is that you feel this pressure. I know a lot of people say that they feel intimidated when they come to a workshop because they feel like people are looking at them or watching and they're afraid to make a mistake. And I always say, you know, it's the opposite of that. I feel like when you go to a workshop, that's the time to make mistakes. That's the time to be brave and do things that are uncomfortable. Because the great news is, you might discover something wonderful. And even if it's a total flop, you have two teachers and a room full of other students who are there to help you. So I think even though it can be scary to create with others, it's a great opportunity for some bravery. So I just finished making my fabulous journal with its awesome textured cover. And you can see both sides are fabulously textured. We're using a ribbon binding, which I think looks really cool. And in Because I've never bound uh, an art journal together. And I was surprised how easy it actually was. And I came home from our little like workshop testing, put it together session. And I made my second art journal all by myself, binding it together. And it was awesome and it worked. And inside I have some pages that are already painted and started because Natalie and I are gonna be showing you so many cool techniques and some pages are blank, leaving me to do whatever I want with them. But this is a super fun journal that I can't wait to use and to show you how to use and to just, you know, make a good old painty mess in. Lots of fun very cool covers, super texture. I mean, oh, I love it. And then inside... So we're teaching so many techniques in this class, but I think hands down my favorite has to be the magazine images because Natalie uses her magazine images in a different way than I use mine. And that's always exciting when you can show people how to use not only a supply differently, but a free supply differently. You know, so I um, I love teaching with Natalie because a lot of the art that we make, um, we have similar philosophies about teaching, which I think is really important when you're teaching with somebody, but also because she approaches things slightly differently than me always. We have the same supplies, the same tools, she's always going to come at it. And so not only do I enjoy teaching with her because I think she's a fantastic teacher and I love seeing the students respond to her, but also because I feel like I learn things along the way. And Julie has this amazing ability to get like people to really uh, let go of their fears and overcome, you know, like this perfection um, struggle that we all know, you know, in our normal daily life, we all have to strive in a way for perfection. You so my hope is that by coming to our three-day workshop, not only are you going to have a great time because we're fun, as if you can't tell that, but also because you're going to have such a wonderful community of artists who are excited to share, who are there to lend their support, who are there to help you through things and, you know, really just share all those kinds of important things that happen when you talk about art. I mean, I think it's the modern day quilting bee, right? The other thing is I'm really hoping that Natalie and I both talk a lot about the whys of things and that's so that you can go home and use these techniques on your own without our guidance. So I'm hoping that will empower you, which I think is the best thing that you can take away from a class to feel empowered. And finally, I really hope that will expand your creativity and make you take some brave steps some big leaps and do things that maybe you're a little uncomfortable about, but by the end, you'll be sorry. Back at the Mixed Media Circus Art dun, Journal dun, Adventure. Dun, 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 dun. It's going to be fabulous because we are so much fun. I, I think they're going to have a really good time. Yeah. I think so too. Always. So, join us! <laughs> <laughs> we Let's try that again. Okay, ready? One more time. <laughs>